Hello and welcome outdoors. I am Amanda and in this week's class we have a gentle relaxing yoga flow. So if you're stressed or you just need a couple minutes to yourself in your day, try this class, grab your mat and let's get started. All right, so we're gonna start in a seated, comfortable position. You can have your legs crossed like I am. You can be sitting on your heels. You can be on a block or on a pillow in lotus pose, whatever is actually comfortable. And then close your eyes here, bring your hands to your knees, and just take a few deep breaths in and out through the nose. And just take note of the sound of your breath. Feel your feet on the ground, your bum on the mat, and just land right here in your body. Anytime the mind wanders, just bring it on back to the sound of my voice, to the sound of your breath. And try and maintain a nice, steady, even breathing through the nose throughout this practice. One more inhale and exhale. On your next inhale, open your eyes, shrug your shoulders up towards your ears and then exhale, let them fall. Inhale, shrug, and exhale, let them drop. Take two more. Releasing tension with every drop. And then one breath here. On your next inhale, bring the shoulders forward and exhale, round them back. Some nice circles here with the shoulders. If you want to, you can close your eyes and just really tune in to the sensations in the body. And then switch your direction. Again, flowing with the breath. Come back to neutral. Inhale the arms up overhead, reaching through the fingertips, press the palms together. And exhale the arms down. Inhale them up again. And exhale down. Inhale up. This time on the exhale, take a gentle twist towards the right as your arms fall, left hand in front of you, right hand behind you. You can gaze over the right shoulder. Inhale, reach up and exhale. Let the hands fall, right hand in front and take the gaze over the left shoulder. Inhale, the arms up again, reaching, and exhale, arms down to your knees. Roll onto your back. And then lift your feet off the mat and create a 90 degree angle with your knees here. So press the lower back into the mat. The core should be really engaged here. And then lift the hands straight above the shoulders. Inhale, on an exhale, lower your left foot down as you bring your right hand behind you. And then inhale up. Exhale, drop the right foot and lower the left hand behind you. Inhale up. So keep going here at the pace of your own breath. This is quite the <laughs> coordination. It always trips me up alternating these hands. So just kind of flow with it. Have fun, put a little smile on your face and make sure that the core is definitely engaged here. Take two more each side.
<laughs> and then hug your knees into your chest, roll around. Hug your right knee in and then extend your left leg straight, drop that heel on the mat and just take a few breaths here. Point through the toes, really extend that left leg long. Then inhale, bring the left leg back, hug everything in, one breath. And exhale, straighten the right leg, bring the right heel down, hug the left knee in. Inhale, hug again, squeeze yourself nice and tight, and then exhale, release, roll over back to your hands and your knees. Hands are right underneath the shoulders, the knees are underneath the hips. Inhale, exhale, drop the belly, take the gaze up, and then exhale, tuck the tailbone, drop the chin. Inhale, drop the belly, and exhale, tuck the tailbone, drop the chin. So keep going here with these cat cows, the own pace of your breath. Take one more of each. And then we'll meet back in a neutral tabletop. Inhale, extend your right hand and then your left foot. Again, engage the core here, find the balance, point the left toes down. Exhale, drop. Inhale, extend the left hand and the right foot, right toes point down. Exhale, drop. One more each side. Inhale, extend. And exhale, drop. Inhale, extend. Exhale, drop. Tuck your toes, lift your knees, and come into downward facing dog. First down dog, so pedal out the knees if you need to. You want your fingertips spread wide, pressing into the mat to protect the wrist, and then Take the gaze in between the legs. Your feet are about hip width apart. And take a few deep breaths here. Look forward between your hands. Step your right foot forward. Spin your left heel down. Then inhale up, warrior one. So the right heel is over or under the right knee. Nice, strong back leg here. And exhale, bring the hands down. Step your right foot back to down dog. Look forward between the hands again. Inhale, step the, the left foot forward. Spin the right heel down. Feel nice and stable here. Then inhale up, warrior one. Exhale the hands down, step the left foot back to downward facing dog. We're gonna do warrior one on each side one more time. So look forward between the hands, inhale, step the right foot forward, left heel comes down, inhale up. Exhale the hands down, step the right foot back into downward facing dog. Again, step the left foot forward, spin the right heel down, inhale, exhale down, step the left foot back into downward facing dog. Drop your knees to the mat and come to seated on your heels. If this is not comfortable for you, you can stick a block or even a pillow underneath your butt right in between your heels and that will help to alleviate any discomfort. So find a nice comfortable seat, roll your shoulders back so the shoulder blades are coming down the back, bring your hands to your knees and take a few deep breaths here. On an inhale, shrug the shoulders up again and exhale, let them fall. 
inhale shrug and exhale let them fall one more time and exhale down on the inhale lift the arms up bend your right elbow so that the hand comes behind the shoulder blades i'll spin around so you can see so right hand is in between the shoulder blades and then you can grab a hold of the right elbow with the left hand and then just get a nice gentle stretch through the tricep exhale release and we'll do the other side so inhale the left hand up bend the elbow so that the hand comes in between the shoulder blades and then the right hand comes around and gently holds the left elbow exhale release bring the arms down now we're gonna wrap the arms here in this little eagle arms so right elbow comes underneath the left and then maybe the hands wrap around and press the palms together inhale lift the elbows so that they're in line with the shoulders and just hold here exhale release spread your wings and we'll switch sides so this time the left elbow comes underneath and the hands twist around and lift the elbows up so that they're in line with the shoulders exhale spread your wings and bring your hands down to your knees come on to seated now so straighten your legs in front of you I like to lift my legs up a little bit in a rotation through the thighs. The toes are coming towards the face. Press the legs into the mat. Roll the shoulders down the back and bring the hands right by your hips, fingertips facing forward. The lower belly is tucked in and engaged. I know this looks easy, but it actually is quite a challenge to hold. Take one more breath here and then exhale, fold over the legs in a nice forward fold. Don't force it here. Make sure that your shoulders are not crunching up towards the ears and just melt into this fold. Inhale, look up. Exhale, release. Bring the bottoms of your feet together. Bring the heels in as much as you can. Same thing, roll the shoulders back, the shoulder blades down so you have a nice proud chest here. Inhale and then exhale, fold forward. The elbows stay close to the ribs here. inhale come up and exhale roll to your back keeping your legs the same so the bottoms of your feet are still together and then just roll back put one hand on your heart and one hand on your belly and if you need to you can always put some pillows or even some blocks under your knees for a little more comfort if you need it and then just relax here Feeling your heart beating, feeling your belly rise and fall with every breath. And then if you want to, you can stay in that position or you can totally relax in a straight legs and your palms facing up in this final resting pose for a few breaths.
when you're ready, you can wiggle your fingers and your toes and hug your knees into your chest and make your way up to seated. And we'll just end this class with a few deep breaths. So we'll inhale through the nose and exhale, sigh out through the mouth. Inhale. And exhale, sigh out. One more time, inhale. Thank you so much for joining me on the mat in this beautiful place. I hope you got a chance to just relax, even if it's just for a little while. It's so important to take time for yourself. So let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed this and make sure to subscribe for more yoga and outdoor resources. I love you and I'll see you on the mat soon. Peace.